Would you be interested in a terabyte of storage for a single dollar? Well, then you're in luck as Folio Photonics plans to do exactly that through their new method for breakthrough optical disk storage. They say that by using new materials and manufacturing techniques, they can offer storage at $5 per terabyte and eventually $1 per terabyte. Also, by the way, if your display has suddenly lost all color, that's a very common issue that you can fix by simply following this channel. Pretty crazy, right? Anyways, modern archival discs offer up to three optical layers per side of disc, whereas Folio can achieve 16 and plans for even more. This wouldn't banish SSDs into the Shadow Realm anytime soon, but could serve as a fantastically affordable archival storage. So I really hope this does come to market, that this does in fact happen in such a way that they are describing, because having this much cheap archival storage would be really great. Now, obviously this is probably a long time away, you know, having simply a prototype and then having a whole supply chain and manufacturing process, you know, uh, set up at a massive scale, that's a completely di different thing. And, you know, in the meantime, a big giant uh, storage, uh, you know, hard drives company like Western Digital, or like Samsung, you know, they can come in and buy them out and then maybe raise the prices. Uh, but this is really awesome, really cool. Uh, you know, obviously we all have smartphones and such things these days. Uh, you know, so you kind of do need a lot of backup storage if you, you know you take a lot of photos, videos, such things. And not everyone wants to back things up to cloud solutions. Uh, you know, that is quite simply because you can't really completely trust someone with your data. You know, there's data breaches uh, every single day pretty much at this point uh you know you have stories of many employees doing illegal behavior with the customer's data and so on you know like the only way you really know your data is safe secure that you're the only one with your data is to really have your own private server private nas whatever which is pretty expensive but i mean this could make it uh this could make it a great alternative uh, what I'd be interested in is uh, how long these things actually last. There are technologies for archival Blu-ray discs uh, out there that last, I believe, like a thousand years, you know. Obviously, we can't know that for sure, you know, we'll know in about a thousand years. But, you know, if these things can actually last a few decades, you know, that, that'd be really great. Uh, and, uh, yeah, I mean, it's super exciting. I would definitely be interested in something like this. Uh, down the line and you know as smartphones and cameras and everything continue to improve as we get high resolutions uh, as we fit in uh, more color data for example with HDR and such things you know the file sizes just become gigantic and you know throughout someone's lifespan they are probably going to generate a ton of data that would be nice to be able to back up at a private storage solution as opposed to a cloud storage solution where you don't really own your own data anymore.